what's up guys and welcome to a new episode of pokemon safe version in previous episode we defeated team wide's hideout you know we invaded team wide's hideout and got to know that the team wide's leader has unleashed has captured dark rye so in today's episode and we also evolved our pokemon look at the team yeah definitely looks lovely anyways in today's episode we are gonna try to stop the team leader but before that let's talk to Laurie. Go, so you did it. What? He did work? So he caught Dark Rai, okay. He'll use it to destroy the world. Things don't look nice. Back then, the Shadow Crystal and Dark Rai was purified by three gems. The blue, the red, and the yellow gem. Okay. If there would be a way to gather these three things, we could on paper stop Shen Hu. Shen now. I just got a message from the policeman investigating the hideout. hideout. They found the Shadow Crystal, but it is broken. Did the process break the crystal? That's impossible, or is it? Anyway, now our only concern should be location of three gems. Haha, ha. I've heard rum rumors of a mysterious red rock hiding in the Lofo cave, laying under Ahi town. So let's go to Ahi town and try to get the red gem. Because, you know, we need to save the world. So, Ahi town, where is Ahi town? Um, wait. There it is. So let's go to Ahi Town and we have to go to the Lofo Cave, which is, if I'm correct, down here. This should be the Lofo Game. No, this is a gym. Okay, here it is. According to the folks, I'll go ahead. Okay, okay, you should go ahead. I'm gonna trust all these trainers here, I guess. You know, because that's the only thing we can do at this point. So Axie is going to war the next level. So that's pretty damn good for us. You know. Axie is gonna evolve. We're going to have a nice factual in our team. And yeah. So let's see. I did bring my hands on some full heals. So let's just quickly use those. Good to know. Let's just move on. A Growlithe. Okay. So up here you can find fire type Pokemon, I guess, which is dope. Oh yeah, I just forgot this guy is a fairy. Oh no. Okay. Fairies, what can fairies be defeated from poison? Does Beedrill have a poison type move? I, I don't know, let's see. I think it does not. It does have steel type, which is super effective though. So, super effective steel type moves on this Pokemon here. I could have also went with Pin Missile and that would have gave me Stab. I will go with Pin Missile on this guy then. Pin Missile, you. Okay, you defeat me, no problem. We have the Star Raptor with the A release. Good, good teamwork, people. Good teamwork. Anyways, let's just quickly move on. Oh, Magby, nice. So if you guys want a uh, Magmar in this, your team, this is the place to be. Anyways, a Raichu, okay. I'm gonna just go with the Dragon Dance. Oh, will we be able to outspeed it? Um, I'm gonna take the risk. Let's do it. Yeah, there we go. Defeated. Axie is a beast right now. Like one Dragon Dance, and Axie becomes a beast instantly. Let's go with Star Raptor. We are going to go with Psybeam. Not even a problem for us. We're gonna just defeat you. Let's go back to Axew. You know, because Axew is going to get some experience right now. And let's go with another relay. It's pretty simple, pretty easy, good to know. Let's go back to Axew. And now let's go to Samurott. I could even go with Snorlax. I forgot to train up Snorlax. Oh man, <laughs> I should have trained him up. I just forgot. Anyways, Axew grew to level 38, Axew should evolve, and there you go, got our hands on a Fracture. Good to see you here in this game, okay. So Fracture feels a lot more stronger than Axew, so that's a good thing for us. I think the red orb is somewhere here, so let's just quickly move on. Oh, Darumuka, which means you can get your hands on Darumuka, which is pretty good. Anyways, Dragon Claw, you one shot kill. Dragon Claw, this guy. Yeah, definitely. Okay, Swagger. I hate Swagger though. Okay, so that hit. Good to know. A Drift Plane. Um, yeah, let's go with Samurott, you know. Because why not? Let's go with some Surfs. Some nice, sweet Surfs here and there. And not last is Du, du Aeon. Okay, let's go with another Surf. And that should be enough. Good to know, let's get the TM, TM28, nice TM I guess, and let's take these guys out, like there are so many trainers up here, 
German Chan. Oh man, it's faster. Come on, okay. Um, let's go with some air releases. A trash, okay, no problem. Air release. Livani, okay, one air release should be enough. And next up is Maractus, okay, one air release should be enough for you too. And Star Raptor Group level 41, learning agility not required. Let's move on. How are you doing? Lumion, okay. I'm gonna go with Slash. Okay, did nothing. Let's go with Star Raptor. Go with a fly. Let him do whatever he wants to do. And let's go with a quick attack. Good to do. Okay, next up is Two Blade. This is the only Pokemon we cannot defeat easily. Um, let's go with Fly. Let's. Oh man, Slash also works on Fly. Okay, I did forgot something. Okay, I knew Slash works on Fly. Okay, Iron Defense. I'm gonna go with Metronome. Hope it works. Okay, I'm gonna revive uh, Samurott because you know, come on, that's a Dew Blade. We need to defeat a Dew Blade. Um, let's go with Surf. That should be pretty much enough, and it is okay. So next up is a Sceptile, and I don't know why I stayed in. Okay, he's going to go with some moves. Okay, agility, not even a problem. Go with the air release. That should be enough to take you out. And next up is Beedrill. Don't have a Mega Beedrill. Good to know. There we go. Defeated. Next up is this lady up here. We're gonna just, you know, serve this Pokemon out. Next up is a Graveler. Let's just quickly serve this Pokemon out. And there we go. Easy peasy. This is going to be the fire lab and Samurott is going to gain some nice levels right here and that's good. So let's surf you out. There you go, Samurott at level 44 now. Lamp into the fire type. Surf you out, okay. And pretty much good, okay. So after the previous episode, Samurott is like a beast incarnate because he's able to defeat almost anything on his way which is so damn cool and so damn useful right now don't have water absorb okay it doesn't good to know let's go with aqua jet defeated kecleon kecleon is gonna become a water type no it isn't let's up is audino audino is pretty tanky pokemon but it also gives a lot of experience as you guys saw and i'm gonna just slash this pokemon though and go with a nice surf here in there good to know Samurott group level 45, it's learning Aquatail. What is Aquatail? A 90 power attack. Good to know, okay. Aquatail is a lot better than Aquajet, definitely. But I cannot remove Surf. Okay, let's remove Aquajet. Aquatail, we have Aquatail. Good to know. Anyways, I'm gonna just go here too because, you know, why not? And let's just defeat this Pokemon. We cannot, okay. I'm gonna let's shift to Star Raptor straight off the back. And this guy is going to go with Leech Seed. Um, I'm just gonna go with Air Release. Hopefully, it kills. Good to know. Next up is a Basculin. Basculin is a water type Pokemon. We're gonna slash this Pokemon up here. Easy peasy. Next up is Stoutland. Okay, this is going to be a little hard one. Aquatail. I don't want to go with Revenge because, you know, we'll die straight off the back. And. There is an item up here which we are gonna get. It's a max elixir, very very nice item. You can get. Anyways, oh, we can get a Fletchendo here too. Good. And definitely we get born from the flame body. I hate you, Fletchendo. I hate you. Anyways, uh, hopefully no one else is there for the red gem because you know my my team is pretty much dead at this point. So hopefully no one comes. Hopefully we'll be able to get the gem and hopefully we'll survive it's very hot in there well i guess there we are oh excuse me can i get the red gem yes indeed i've heard about the red gem i'm the guardian of the gem what but hasn't it protected by heat twin at least that's what the folk tales said those folk tales in fact are true but there was some time ago 12 years ago the red gem was entrusted to a pokemon ranger from omiya before he disappeared he gave the gem to three guardians here in colon so one is me okay i see I know this will sound weird, but we need the red gem. In fact, we'll need all of the gems. What? You would... Why would you two need items with such power? An evil organization has restored the shadow's crystal dark state. But that they awaken dark Rai and they will use it to destroy the world. Okay, so now 
they're going to be just continuing on so i protected i'll challenge one of you okay well i must go you know you can be it so gold i hope you can win okay at least our pokemon are definitely you know healed up so maybe we'll be able to defeat you know okay a charizard dragon claw yeah dragon dance enough for a dragon claw okay, okay. there you go charcoal dragon claw star raptor let's go with a quick attack with a release okay star raptor going to some decent level let's just fly and take you out infernip is down next up is agron okay um okay bad switch bad switch let's go with samurai serve this pokemon out aquatail you out and a slash okay another slash should do okay there you go okay very well okay there you have it now i'll go we did it okay reaching the place where the next gem is going to be a log journey i hear people talking about a golden moon shaped stone being hidden deep in pator forest description is pretty much of yellow gem route 9 is the north of route 8 but you can see that on the map too so we have to go to the Paddles forest on route 9 okay makes sense so let's quickly go out of this place you know and head towards route 9 the Pator's forest because that's the place where we have to go also it's so cool we have got another evolution in today's episode so our team looks to growing very very strong at this point which is pretty much useful because come on think about it we have defeated a seven gym with really very really weak pokemon think about it we didn't have star raptor at that point we didn't have i think we had samurott uh, but i'm not sure i don't remember did we have samurott in the last episode check it out anyways before the gym for the seven gym so think about it now we are training up we, now we are getting our levels high and think about it we got 10 levels from previous episode which is absolutely unbelievable but there we go we have to go to the route 10 if i'm route 8 if i'm correct so this is route 4 this is route 10 this is route 9 and this is route 8 and this should be here should be the paris forest okay so we have to go from spiritua city to the up area to go get our hands to the next place okay so let's just quickly move on and Fraxuar is just checking out this route we checked this route out in the previous episode if i'm correct so let's just quickly move on and now we can talk to these guys now we can battle these guys which is definitely make make sense okay come on of course it does okay this guy i'm definitely sure doesn't have okay it does have a lot of weight oh man this munchlax is so strong even stronger than my snorlax okay later on we can take you out serve you out you know semi sage we are gonna serve you out and there we go defeated pretty much easy hmm <sighs> okay so we have a torterra here let's just go with some nice dragon claws oh man okay we lost but we do have star raptor in our team so there we go defeated pretty much easy here so next up is a swell hole we're gonna serve you out and we're gonna move on right so hopefully i avoided most of the trainers because come on there are so many trainers up here okay go with the side beam i'm gonna go with revenge you're down next up is a dito he's gonna copy me let's go with surf take him out first good to know and uh, let's get the max ether here and go to the father's forest okay so we have to wild this guy definitely so for patter's forest we definitely require someone who is capable of defeating um bugs which means we require someone who is very, very powerful like star raptor so i'm gonna put star raptor up in front he, he's gonna be pretty useful here hopefully he's gonna make us win so star raptor is in the team parasect let's see what we'll do okay and let's just take out this parasect here 
and star raptor is gaining some more levels good to know good to see our pokemon growing up here and let's just take you out now star raptor is going to be extremely powerful for this place because oh i didn't i want to shift come on okay so star raptor and samurai are pretty much enough to take this place out empoleon um um what can i say revenge maybe yeah pretty much enough so how are you doing okay you want to have butterfree and all those but pokemon pretty much easy to defeat these pokemon you know uh, and they are simple and easily defeatable so okay this is a wild one how are you doing okay so you have a wasp queen pretty much okay so you toxic me that's a good technique because you know toxic is the only thing which is going to make us you know use a full heal and that's thing which i don't want to use right now petal dance of course uh let's go with b drill b drill does have drill run which is super effective no which is effective not super effective sorry but it confused okay okay b drills out you're out Staraptor is in okay let's go with the fly don't die a lot oh man okay the, the toxic's gonna take me out take down let's go with take down yes there you go okay let's just quickly use our full heal on our star raptor and also a max potion i don't know i'm gonna anyways heal up our pokemon so maybe not required to use a max potion anyways let's just go fly i'm gonna just fly right now because you know fly is gonna give us a lot of ex health back so and that's actually pretty much what we require at this point so this is going to give some help help to us and then we are gonna fly again get some more health and star raptors get in there okay so that was a glitch right there if you guys didn't see so the green light actually became yellow which doesn't make much sense right now but now it is again green so yeah that was a glitch there but whatever anyways Let's just defeat these guys. I was talking about the HP one, if you guys didn't notice, but got another TM, good to know. And um, where should we go? We have to go this side, definitely. So, Bug Catcher is again here. We're gonna just A release. Stun Spore, that's not gonna be pretty much okay. That's gonna be a lot useful for you right now because Stun Spore is okay. Okay, this is going to be hard one. Okay, I'm gonna revive someone. I'm gonna revive our Samurott. This is going to be extremely hard one. So let's go with Samurott, Iron Head, not effective, and just surf you out. Pretty much easy. And let's get our hands on an energy root. And how are you doing? Another bug catcher here. So we're gonna fly. We're gonna fly high in the sky. Okay, we're gonna fly again. Okay, let's just get some more. Oh, come on. Why are you embolized with love? You like love? You like love so much. Come on. Why am I so much paralyzed? Okay, that was one of the hardest battles right now. Come on. Seriously, we were paralyzed like two times. At least. Oh, again paralyzed. Definitely. Okay, I'm gonna wait. We got... We got some, you know, health back. So, sword stance. Go with that sword stance. I don't even care. Okay, I do care now. Um, let's go with a slash. Okay. Okay, we are dead. We are definitely... We are so dead. Let's just... Uh, okay, we are dead. That's, that's it. Okay, I'll just come back here, you know, pretty quickly. And this is also a glitch. Don't know why this happens all the time. But, um, where am I? Okay, I'll just come back. Okay, guys, so I'm back and let's just defeat this Pokemon trainer once and for all. Let's go with some nice A releases. At least we are not paralyzed this time like we were last time. So we'll be able to one hit KO all of the Pokemon, hopefully. And there we go. Pretty much easy. Staraptor is level 47 now, which is nice. Now let's take out the next one which is Yama also 
while I was reaching this place, our factual got paralyzed and, you know, his HP also went down because he was paralyzed. Anyways, uh, let's go with factual, I guess, you know. We're gonna go with some dragon claws here. And uh, let's go with Samurai Revenge because he's definitely faster than us. So Revenge to be pretty much enough to take you out. And there we go. Now, this is the place. I'm definitely correct. So we might have to battle him. So her. So whatever it is, him or it's her definitely. So let's just fly back and go with a release. Pretty much enough. And next up is a golem. I, I forgot. Why don't I shift my Pokemon? I should swift no shift whatever switch switch i should switch my pokemon anyways a magnesone okay we can go with some nice surfs here and there you know magnesones are pretty much good okay next up is septile and definitely it's faster i should have went with staraptor before but whatever we're gonna still defeat staraptor is going to gain a lot of experience right now next up is fracture he's going to be going with um one dragon dance, go with another dragon spikes, okay, faint attack, now we're gonna be able to one hit kill it, still no man, so this Greninja was pretty powerful, anyways, there you go, very well, you s mean to be worthy of the yellow badge, gem, okay, now we should go for the third gem, which is in another island of the third place, so go there, okay, I'll go there, so let's quickly get head back out, and um we'll go there in the next episode or in today's episode okay we'll go in there in today's episode because you know we still have some time to go there and it only takes 10 minutes to go to every place so let's quickly head back all the way to the main area and then well anyways let's quickly just you know try to head back as fast as possible yeah there we go, and we have to now fly to back to the light island, I, if I'm correct. So let's go to light island, and there you are. Okay, many small marines are heading again. Oh, come on. Now I understand this is a glitch. So we, we Tron just told me yesterday, you know, on the comments of the previous episode that this is a glitch. This should not happen every time. But anyways, let's just move on. Okay, in order to find out the blue gems possible location, things aren't too great. 99% of the possible, you know, places are underwater caverns. So we are sure it's somewhere underwater. However, there are hundreds of caves under the whole sand sea and sea between Cole and Hoenn. I asked a sailor if he could take us to the largest cavern, you know, to just look around. He said he'll take us, so please approach him at the pier, you know, because we want to see him. So let's just take a uh, talk to this guy on the right, if I'm correct. Okay, so we are came here. So hello, how are you doing? We'll just dive there. Okay, I'm good to know. Well, this should be the cave. Okay, so this is for heading out. I can't believe it. So, but this isn't strange. Okay, thanks for telling us. So it's three against two. There's no reason. Okay, so we're gonna battle these guys. Pretty much easy. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully this is going to not take much while. Okay, okay, okay. Swagger, swagger, no problem. Don't don't get confused. Yeah, good to know. And next is Zip Strike. Okay, all of them are going to be electric types. So, okay, only two Pokemon are there. Okay, we can go with some nice Dragon Claws here and there. And go with a... Oh, okay, Dragon Range. There we go, defeated. Okay, one more is coming, so... This time let's just fly high in the sky and we're gonna air release the sky and next up we're gonna fly high in the sky and take you out next up is seismic toad let's go with samurot and hopefully go with some nice surfs because surf is pretty powerful against seismic toad and last but not least is a flying type himself pgot pretty much you know not even a competition for Staraptor because you know Staraptor is a beast here and Pidgeot is like nothing against Staraptor. Up is Radicate. Let's go with Samurott and go with a revenge killing revenge. There we go and defeat it. How did these kid defeat me? Okay, we should be all heading to Mount Desort anyway for the plans of final step. So we should grab the gym and leave as fast as we could. They were talking about Mount Desort. Gold, we should hurry there. 
two of the gems okay so now it's probably like going to do something at the mountain's peak we must get to shore city it's at the bottom of the mountain so we have to go to the shore city and that's what we are gonna do in you know we are going to go to the mountain in the next episode so let's just head to the shore city which if i'm correct is somewhere here maybe maybe here okay grower city spiritual city one pie city show okay so we are going to go to shore city so let's just quickly heal our pokemon and head straight up forward to shore city you know cause why not okay and shore city is also the city for the last gym which is definitely you know cool if i'm correct so uh let's just head to shore city wow it's pretty cold up here and it sure is man it sure is so i'll see you guys in in this episode until then bye bye sayonara and peace out we got all three gems in today's episode bye bye